بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم نو اسٹارٹ الوحد الخامسہ ففتھ یونٹ اتعام و شراب فوڈز اینڈ ڈرنکس الوحد الخامسہ ففتھ یونٹ اتعام و شراب فوڈز اینڈ ڈرنکس الدرس السابع و سلاسون تھرٹی سیون لیسن الارد پیزنٹیشن الحوار الاول فرسٹ ڈیلوگ انظر وسط میں وائد لک اینڈ لسن اینڈ ریپیٹ قاسم اینا تذہبو یا سالم ویر آر یو گوئنگ او سالم تذہبو یو آر گوئنگ ویر آر یو گوئنگ او سالم سالم ریپلائیز ایل المتعمی to the restaurant or you can also say to the canteen Qasim Kam wajbatan ta'kulu fil yawm How many meals do you eat in the day? So I told that after the word kam the next word must be singular and it must have fatah So you see that wajba is singular word and it has fatah then preposition fi has given kasra to yawm salim aakulu salasa wajabatin al fatura wal ghada wal asha'a i eat three meals the breakfast and the lunch and the dinner so this word salasa is telling us about the verb so it has fatah and from 3 to 10 anything which is counted must have kasra and it must be plural so that's why you see that wajba is also between 3 and 10 it is 3 number so it is plural and it has kasra next kasim haza kasirun jiddan this is too much. Jiddan means too, kasiran much. This is too much. Ana aakulu wajbatan wahidatan. I eat one meal. So wajba is, the, the action of the verb is done on wajba, so it has fatah. Then adjective and the manut should have same sign. Saim arab, that's why it has fatah. So someone is asking Tazabu is present tense. So in Arabic we have only three tense. In English we have 12 tenses. In English we have 12 tenses. But in Arabic we have three tenses only. So for present and future we say Tazabu, Yazabu. Sometimes we use the particle Sa or Sa but it is also in Zare. We'll study it later, inshallah, in the day. Haza kalilun jiddan. This is too little. Haza kalilun jiddan. This is too little. Qasim, maza ta'kulu fil gada. What do you eat in the lunch? Gada means lunch. So preposition fi has given it kasra. Aakulul aruzza wal khubza. I eat rice and the bread so the action of the verb is done on rice and the bread so it has fatah and what do you eat kasim i eat fish and salad and fruit and salad and fruit salim or ma, ma was nuka. What is your weight? Kasim. Situna kilan. 60 kilogram. Situna kilan. 60 kilogram. So here I told you from 3 to 10. Anything which is counted must be plural. And it must have kasra. But from 11 to 99. Anything which is counted 
must be singular and it must have fatha. So this 60 is between 11 to 99. So it is singular and it is has fatha 60 kilogram. Wama was nuka anta. And what is your weight? Me atu kilin 100 kilogram. So here first I told you that from 3 to 10 anything which is counted must be plural and it must have kasra then i told you from 11 to 99 it must be singular and it must have fata now for 100 the word must be singular but it must have kasra so you need to remember this also me atu kilin 100 kilogram Kasim Anta Saminun Jiddan, you are too fat. Wa Anta Nahifun Jiddan, you are too skinny. Or you are too weak. Now, if anyone has any questions, she can ask me after unmuting her microphone. I think no question. So I need to. teacher. Wa alaikum salam. Can you read it again? Okay, the student will read it, then it will be a revision for you. Who wants okay. to read and translate? Raise her hand. Miss Saima, you are Kasim, and Miss Satya, you are Salim. Read and translate. Sir, Mamana Vajbatan. Vajba mean meal. Meal, okay. Kam vajbatan ta kulufil yom. Start from the first sentence. Okay, in my book, uh, my book is little change. Okay, I see. Then read from the screen. Aina tazabu. Okay. Aina tazabu ya salim. Ilal mata. Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, Salim. Uh, in Al Matame to the restaurant. Come, Vajbatanta Akulu Fil Yomi. Fil Yomi. How much meal do you take daily? How many meals do you take, do you eat in the day? In the day. Akulu Salaza Vajbatan Vajbatan, it is a plural word. Oh, sorry, sorry. Akulu Salaza Vajbatan. I eat three meals. Al Fatura, Wal Gada, Wal Asha. Breakfast and lunch. And dinner. Ah, hada kathi rujidan. It is too much. Ana akulu vajbatan wahidatan. I just eat one meal. Hasa kalilun jiddan. It is too low. Too little. Oh, it is too little. Mada ta kulufil gadai. What do you eat in lunch? A kulul arusu, wal wal kubas, wal kubza, wal kubza, wal kubza. I eat rice and bread. Wa masa ya kulu anta. And what do you eat? Akulu samaka wa salatata wal fakihata. I take or I eat fish, salad, and fruits. Ma was muka. What is your weight? Sit tu na kilan. Ma was nuka anta. 
मी किलोग्राम अंती सॉरी ओके सर वी आर टॉकिंग सालिम मी अतु कीलिन मी अतु कीलिन हंड्रेड किलोग्राम जिद्दन यू आर टू मच हेल्दी यू टू फैट यू आर टू ऑब्वियसली यू आर टू स्की I think no question. Okay, no question. So we'll proceed. Al Mufaddat vocabulary. Who wants to read the vocabulary? Raise a hand. Miss Rahma, read the vocabulary and tell the meanings also. Mr. Rahman, mute your microphone. Aruzun, Samakun, Kobusun. Tell the meaning yeah. also, Mr. Rahman. You need to tell us the meaning okay. of these words. Okay. Faakehatu, fruits. Fruit, okay. Aru arus rice samakun fish hubus hubus sun bread ya kunu he eating he is eating okay eh okay he is eating he eating mat mato mato am food restaurant mata mean restaurant okay Re restaurant asha u asha lunch dinner asha mean dinner okay dinner gada u lunch fatur break breakfast wajabat mana wajabat meals wajabat meals meals okay meals meals okay waj waj batu mana waj batu meal it is a singular word okay okay meals okay was was no kilo weight was the mean weight eh huh? was the no mean weight 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 okay weight weight kalilun small little kalil mean little little okay little okay little kasirun plenty plenty okay Mia kilin. Mia tu kilin. Okay, mia tu kilin. Hundred kilo. Hundred weight or hundred kilo. Okay. Seminu fat. Nahif. Nahifu. Okay, nahifu. Thin. 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 Okay. Someone one is asking what is the meaning of jiddan? Jiddan means two or very. So it has yeah, these two meaning T W O two, and it also means very. So next we have the leap. Ajib anil asilati bixtisar answer the questions in brief. Ila aina yazhabu salim. Where is salim going? Yazhabu Salim ilal matam. Salim is going to the restaurant. 
Man ya'kulu salasa wajabatin. Salim ya'kulu salasa wajabatin. In this way, you will answer these questions. These questions are your homework. You will write your answers here and upload them to Google Classroom. Any question from anybody? Any suggestion? Anything? Okay. No question, nothing. So we'll proceed to our Excuse dialogue me? practice. Yes, anyone wants to ask a question? It is necessary to give the complete answer of a question. Sorry, I did not understand you. Okay, I can read it. I can. I think she was asking something, but I did not understand her question, what she wants to say. So. Okay, now I need two students who will practice this dialogue. Raise your hand. Okay, Miss Rabi Shehu and Miss Saima Muhammad will practice this dialogue. Miss Saima, ask her, yes, where do you live? Correct. Miss Rabi, are you available? Salam alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. Answer our question. My voice is not too clear because of cough. I'm having cough. Okay. Okay. You can take rest. Anyone else who wants to read? Okay, Ms. Rina, answer our question. Ms. Rina, unmute your microphone. Oh, yeah. Sorry. So, Ms. Saima, ask your question again. Okay. Aina das kunina. Askunu fi baiti. Neighborhood or neighborhood? She's asking you okay. neighborhood. <clears throat> Askunu fi Ask her the same question. Uh, wa aina wa aina Correct. Uh, okay. Do you live in an apartment? Okay. Hal. Uh, okay. Okay. Wa anti haltas kunina fil bait. Hala anti tas kunina fil bait. Naam ana askunu fi bait. Now Miss Saima will visit Miss Rina office and she will say, I want a house. So, Miss, what will Miss Saima say when she will enter the office? She will say, Aslam alaikum. Universe. Miss Saima will greet you. Okay. Assalamu alaikum. Miss Rina will ask, What do you want? Or may I hope may I help you? Mm. Um, how may I help you? Ayah, it's not easy. Ayah. Aina, uh, sorry, Aya Hidmatin. I want a house. 
انا اريد شقته اريد بيتا من فضلك اريد بيتا اريد من فضلك اريد بيتا من فضلك مس رينا you will say we have a beautiful house la daina baitun jamilatun bait is masculine word so you will say baitun jamilun baitun jamilun so miss sama will ask how many rooms are in the room kam ghurfatin fi baitiki it is not her her house you will say kam ghurfatan fil baiti kam ghurfatan fil baiti fi baiti arba'a ghurafin arba'u ghurafin okay arba'u ghurafin miss amma will say i want to see the house uh, ana uridu an ushahida baita uridu mushahadat al baiti uridu mushahadat al baiti so miss rina will say yes please this is the house tafaddal haza baitun tafaddal is for male and miss saima is female so you say tafaddali haza huwa al bait sorry tafaddali haza huwa al bait okay tafaddali haza miss samar will say this is a beautiful house ha uh, hada baitun jamilun okay next time you will start with the buying furniture for your house okay sir we can say hada al baitul jamilu with alif lam or no it is not appropriate answer you but you can use it but simple answer is better okay next time okay. inshallah we will continue if anyone has any question she can ask me now i think nobody has any question